you will find people in this dunya who deny the existence of Allah. You will find people who deny the existence of the angels, who deny the existence of Jannah and Jahannam, heaven and hell. You will find people who even go to the extent of denying the prophethood of the great prophets. But my brothers, that one person you will never find who denies the fact of death that every single one of us will one day die. Worship your Lord, worship Allah until the certainty, until yaqeen comes to you. The Mufassireen, the experts in the field of the Qur'an are unanimous that here by the word yaqeen, certainty, Allah refers to death. So worship your Lord until death comes to you. And as technology advances, as medicine advances, there are people out there who are making efforts to attain everlasting youth. A man by the name of Alexander Bogdanov who was a Russian scientist, philosopher and physician. He, come up, he came up with a unique type of experiment. He invented a special kind of blood transfusion. And what he would do is that he would take the blood of youngsters and his blood and he would transfer their blood into his body and his blood into their bodies. And through this he wanted to achieve everlasting youth. He wanted to avoid death. But the result at the end was that he died after he took the blood of a student suffering from malaria. Death is that certainty. No matter what you do, the law of Allah is Kullu nafsin dha'iqatul maut. Every soul must taste death. The angel of death, my brothers, don't be mistaken. He is not bothered how powerful you are. The angel of death is not bothered if you've got a kingdom. The angel of death will not be scared of you if you're an oppressor, if you're a zalim. He's not bothered. The angel of death is not bothered if you're a rich person, if you've got power. He's not bothered if you've got money. That the angel of death is not bothered who you are. He is not bothered where you are. He is not bothered what you're doing. At your appointed time, you will find him in front of you there to take out your soul and my friends you will die at the appointed time every single person has been given an appointed time a fixed term they will stay in this dunya when your time comes at that time not a minute earlier not a minute later Exactly at that time, the angel of death will be there to take your soul. Only Allah knows when you're going to die. Nobody besides Allah. 